Hi everyone, uh, my name is Megan and I am getting a um, mini spinal 360 fusion tomorrow morning. Um, I couldn't find a lot of information about this specific surgery. I found a lot of information about fusions themselves, um, but not the uh, anterior posterior uh, fusion. So I actually had a dis discectomy and laminectomy uh, 10 years ago. It did great. Uh, obviously I had back pain, but uh, nothing else with that. Uh, I was meal prepping four months ago, three months ago, and just re-herniated my um, disc at the L4, L5, same herniation that I had 10 years ago. And not only did I um, re-herniate my disc, but my vertebrae moved back 50%. Uh, so I also have a grade two spondy something. <laughs> I don't know how to say it. So um, I tried um, physical therapy. I tried many things to get the pain to go away. But um, I mean, I have both feet go numb, legs go numb, butt goes numb, P intense pain in my legs. Um, and it's, uh, it's kind of brutal. So when they told me I had to have the fusion, I was pretty upset because I had always said I would never, ever have a fusion, ever. I have an aunt who's actually disabled and because of a, I don't want to say a botched surgery, but a back surgery that went wrong. And so I've always been super scared of that. So I'm getting the fusion tomorrow. Um, I had my pre-op and they've told me basically because I'm 30 years old, my life is going to change. Um, no more, I love hit cardio and jumping and plyometrics and basically anything CrossFit. I love hard workouts. So that is no longer allowed. I am allowed to swim, do the stair stepper and the elliptical, all things that <laughs> I've never really loved, but I guess I'll eventually start to like them. Um, and they did say that the surgery is going to be pretty rough. I am very, very nervous, but I wanted to um, create a YouTube, a couple YouTube videos of my experience of um, someone as young as me. I have three children. I work full time. I go to school full time. So someone who is along my same lifestyle, maybe um, this will help you since I didn't find very much information about it. Um, so I will let you know all the ins and the outs, the good, bad, the ugly. Um, of my surgery. I did pick up a few things um, just by other regular fusion um, YouTube videos. Um, a few things that I have heard that can help are a walker, a cane, satin sheets so that you can easily slip off or roll off. Not exactly sure how that works yet, um, but I got a grabber. Hopefully that helps. <laughs> Um, because you can't bend for several months. You also can't lift, I think, five to 10 pounds for several months. So um, you really have to change how you do things. Um, I heard showering was a rough one. So I bought this as well. And I also bought um, a couple activity books, adult activity books, um, to kind of pass the time because I'm worried that I'm going to be laid up for a while. I hope I'm not. I hope that I'm just overreacting and it's going to be the best thing I've ever done in my life. So we will see, I will keep you updated um, and uh, let you know how it goes every step of the way. <laughs>